Tabo Mbeki lied about causes of load shedding. Former President Becky referred in his yesterday's speech to the coal stock holding at Eskom in 2007 to 2008. He got the facts wrong. And unless corrected, gullible South Africans will believe the lie. The coal stock until 2008 was 10 days. It changed to 20 days after Thabo Mbeki's government refused to invest in new generation capacity, a severe indictment. Today, the coal stock is 73 days. It is the consequence of a poor energy availability factor. I say this because the reserve margin is healthy. At an average coal price of our 550 per ton and a coal burn of 99. 5 metric tons per annum, the coal stock is worth our 11 billion. That's bad business by any standard. I have not seen the SIU report cited by TM. I submit, given the above facts, that the report was either quoted out of context. Alternatively, it was meant to sanitize the man from Sussex by the Special Investigating Unit SIU. What former President Becky did yesterday was an attempt to change the belief that his government was directly responsible for the first incidents of load shedding in 2007 to 2008. He grossly misrepresented the facts. Of course, Eskim is not going to correct him for obvious reasons. The fact is, the reserve margin in 2007 was down to 2% instead of 15%. The power system ran out of peaking generation capacity. The 1000 megawatts of OCTGs that government promised was nowhere to be found. That is why we quickly had to construct Ankalig and Gorikwa. It took us 19 months to do that. I found former president manipulative, deceitful, and sly in his narrative of what caused load shedding in 2007 to 2008. He needs to man up and accept his culpability. Please like, comment, share and follow this channel for more information or updates on news and entertainment.